Hello guys, I'm back and this is going to be my last read aloud. That makes me really sad. Um, but maybe during the summer I can find some cool books to read to you guys. So, today I'm wearing a sleeping mask. See, when I go to sleep I do this and it keeps the light out. And then I have a cozy blanket and I have, uh, today Baby Shark is visiting. So, I have Baby Shark today because I'm going to read you my all-time favorite book, like ever, ever. It's my favorite. I love it. It is called The Napping House. And maybe it's because I like naps. <laughs> love naps. Naps are the best. So, I'm going to pull my blanket there. Uh-oh. Baby Shark fell. Boop. Okay, he's going to sit right here. The Napping House by Audrey Wood, illustrated by Don Wood. See, they're all sleeping. I'm telling you, this is a good book. The Napping House. There is a house, a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. And in that house, there is a bed. A cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. There's the bed. And on that bed, there is a granny, a snoring granny. <laughs> on a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. There's the snoring granny. And on that granny, there is a child. Oh, look, now there's a child sleeping on the granny. A dreaming child. Hmm. On a snoring granny. <sighs> Ooh. On a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that child, there is a dog. A dozing dog. That's what my dog does when she's sleeping. On a dreamy child. On a snoring granny. On a cozy bed. In a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that dog there is a cat. Hey, I have an orange cat. On a, a snoozing cat. On a dozing dog. On a dreaming child. On a snoring granny. On a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that cat, there is a mouse. Oh, it's very hard to see. Right there's the mouse. A slumbering mouse. Squeak, squeak, squeak. On a snoozing cat. <coughs> On a dozing dog. <coughs> On a dreamy child. <coughs> On a snoring granny. <coughs> Ooh. On a cozy bed. In a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that mouse there is a flea. Oh, you can barely see just a little speck on the mouse. A wakeful flea. Oh no. On a slumbering mouse. Squeak, 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 squeak. On a snoozing cat. Meow, 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 meow. On a dozing dog. Ruff, 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 ruff. On a dreaming child, on a snoring granny. Ooh, that kind of sounded like the dog. On a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. What's gonna happen with that wakeful flea? A wakeful flea who bites the mouse. Squeak! There, it went flying. Who scares the cat? Wow! Oh, the cat is so scared. Who claws the dog? Woof! Oh no, that 
poor doggy, so that hurts. Who thumps the child? Oh! The child went flying too. Who bumps the granny? Oh! There, the granny's flying too. Who breaks the bed? Oh no! But she thinks it's funny and she's smiling. In the napping house where no one now is sleeping. And now look, they're all out in the yard playing and having fun together. All because of that silly little flea waking them up from their nap. So, I hope you like the, this book. And, um, like I said, I'll try and see if I can find some other books. Maybe, and I can read them throughout the summer. If not, keep reading with mom and dad and have a wonderful summer, guys. Bye.